got a dishwasher making a loud noise it's from the motor. missing a screw take out that screw there and unplug it and we'll unhook the drain right here and we'll shut the water valve off all right so the water's off it's unplugged take the drain off and we'll get ready to pull it out And we want to remove the water line, which is right here. Just break this nut off, pull the water line out, and we should be able to slide it out. All right, now we're ready to pull it out. We got the water line unhooked, it's unplugged, drains disconnected, the paper towel stuffed in there so it don't drip. And we took the bolt out of the mount there. Go ahead and close it up and pull it out. All right, everything's pulled out. Lay it on its back. And there's our motor. So we'll start with the clamps, pull off the wire harnesses, the bracket, Get everything unmounted, put the new motor in, new motor and pump, which is right there. And unplug our harness, remove this clamp, remove this bracket. Wire harness off your drain solenoid. Come down here. Remove the hose. Get a little bit of water out of your pump. Start with loosening up the clamps. <clears throat> we got another one underneath. Get the uh, drain solenoid. I'll unmount that from the old pump, put it on the new one. Take off your spring, slide that off. plunger down in, that's your drain solenoid. This has to drop down in in order for it to drain. Hook your spring on the arm and down here at the bottom. That's how that'll work. And don't forget your clip. There we go. 
hair clip. Now we're set up. And we're just going to drop this up in here. And you're where your cutter is on your pump, back here. And hook up your little drain hose on the side. And we'll hook this back up here. for your drain solenoid, plug that back in, wire harness for your motor, plug that back in, and we'll put our motor mount back on. Everything underneath besides oh, the drain hose. Put that back on. And I'm actually going to angle this this way. In case we ever have to tighten that up from underneath, we'll be able to get straight into it. Always think of the next guy or the next time. Whichever. Nice and tight. Just double check the others. Alright, everything's snug. So we'll get ready to slide it back in place. All right, dishwasher's all back in place. New motor. New stainless steel braided water line. Go ahead and turn that back on. Plug, plugged in. There's the drain hooked up. So now we'll go ahead and fire it up. Check for leaks. Sounds a lot better already. All right, there's our water. Test out the water and the drain. Make sure everything is good to go. Bone dry in there. Okay, 
Okay, now we'll check the drain. good all right that's replacing a motor on a dishwasher all right thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one